Welcome to the Bosphoran campaign for Davidi et Impera 1.2. Now we're about seven, eight turns on at least from where we left off in the last part. If you've watched the last part, you'll be aware that it finished up here with us destroying the Kartuli or Kartuli, who have been a right pain in the neck for some time because they could add the ability to send down large armies through here, threatening my eastern border. And eventually I got two large armies up here into Rhea and they actually took out the faction and this it means this is now my eastern border. We got these guys over here, I think it's the Fusagete. And but they're okay, they're happy and I'm quite happy to kind of keep them that way. I don't really want to expand that way, just to show you on the map guys. This is our eastern border. You can see these guys have got a large province. You can see down here we've got the Sakuraku, and I'm quite happy for these guys to act as a buffer while I expand my empire, which will be in this direction through the south. On the western border here, we were fighting the Bastanians and the Scorditsi, and what's actually happened is the Lugi have actually declared war. They destroyed the Bastanians, and they are now fighting a war across here. And at the moment, I'm just quite happy to watch that. Um, these, the Lugi like us because we're sharing the war, but I might come down here and do a bit of raiding and liberating just to upset the Scorditsi, but I don't really want to expand because the problem I've got is that if I expand this, oops, if I expand this way, guys, I will start building a province here, which will take me closer to Rome. You can see Rome's over here. And I'm not ready for that. I'm quite happy to have this, these two fighting each other. I mean, if if, if something happens here, and um, say the the Ludgi lose this area here in Dacia, we may push out and expand that way. But at the moment, I'm, I've only got the one army there, so I don't really want to get into a battle. The main focus in this part is going to be down here. I need to break out this way, and the idea is is to push through here. And then expand this way and then we can come back up this way and consolidate an empire in this in the eastern side here then then that will allow us to move this way and at the moment I'm kind of cultivating the Sukhalids they they're they're acting as a very nice buffer just to show you diplomatically guys so the Sukhalids are down here and at the moment we're they're slightly more powerful than me but you can see they're at war with Media Atropine and I think is it Persia which would be down here. So I want to take advantage of that war to expand down this way. I think that will... will let's just get out of there. Our main focus in this part is going to be down here. And to begin with we got to take out this minor faction here. They were defensive allies with the uh, Sukhalids. I just want to make sure that they haven't reformed that allegiance. No, they're actually at war with Medra Atropine. And so what we're actually going to do is declare war on these. I've got my two main armies here ready to go. Hopefully these guys will yeah, they'll be able to sweep in and destroy them. I, I think what we're actually going to do is... If I could join the war... Let's see. I joined the war then, but that would upset the Sukhalids. I think what we're going to do, the idea is, is I'm going to come in here, declare war. That will upset the Sukhalids, but then I will immediately declare, declare war on media atrophy, which would make the Sukhalids happy with us again. So the Sukhalids are happy with us at the moment, so we're just going to declare war. Here. Greetings, friend. Let us use our time yeah. together. That would be, so oops. be it. And that will mean that the Sukhalids will not like us. Now, they've gone there, but if we go in, take these guys out. And it's going to come. I think actually let's bring both armies forward. I want to keep the casualties as low as possible. So you come down here. And this guy is one of our family. So he can actually improve our overall thing okay we've got this here 
Mm. Yeah, we're, we're okay, guys. So I think we're, I'm going to still fight this just to minimise the casualties. I'm, I know that Evans, so we're just going to fight this, guys. It should be a quick battle. Battle of Ar Ar Armin Armivar. Okay, they've come out against us. Right, nice and dry. Start the deployment. And got a little bit of hills there. Uh, I don't think we need to worry. It's our army's coming in on that side, so. And I think what I'm going to do is have the these guys on the back. Um, I think we're just going to set them back a little bit like that. Gonna have the artillery kind of behind like that. They've got cav, so. I think we'll have just have the general in the center there. We'll have our horse archers out on the flank. And what else we keep a bit of a careful eye on these guys. You, you can just hang out there. Now we've got our reinforcements coming in on that flank, so I think we'll just keep these guys back this way. Have these across the front like that, and I think you guys can go on flanking shot and cover that flank. I think that's about it. The horse archers should cover what their cav. They've got a lot of cav on that flank. That could be a problem. I think what we will do is just curve these guys in a little bit. And bring these guys up this way. Okay, let's start the battle. And I think what I would like to do is kind Enemy of. reinforcements approaching. Okay. Need to do is make sure the reinforcements do not come in behind us. That could be annoying. And we'll bring our. Up this side. Okay. I think I want you guys to basically take down their light cavalry. Bring our horse archers in. Don't want to throw them away. Defensive line on this side. And of course, there's our big strong Sarcher contingent. And of course, we've got these guys as well. They can come in. I think these slingers, I think you guys can break back now. Because their cavalry could probably run them down. Guys, ready? Slingers. Yep. Break onto this flank. Okay. More archers. Those cab generals this way. Of course, these guys can come in this way. The horse archers that side. These guys are quite literally going down. Okay. Very, very tempted to kind of go in on One this of our units has used all its ammunition. Guys, get back to here. Okay. What are we doing? How are we doing over this side? Oh, 
Horse archers there. Yep, those guys have gone. Horse archers over here. Horse archers. Put these guys up here. These guys can fire into the center. The archers around the back here. Ready for orders. Missile infantry at your command. Guys come out that way. Take down that very heavy shock cav. Yeah, that'd be. I mean, these guys are very, very nimble, so. Yeah, we're tearing up that shock cav. The enemy general is dead. Hey. Bring in these guys. Okay. Bring these guys round. Come in on their archers. There. Right, got their archers on this flank. Plates forward. Got a nice big contingent of royal guard here. Going down. I think you guys have finished. Okay, you guys break off that way. The battle is turning in our yep. favor. Right, you guys come in this way. Cavalry, you keep hitting these guys. Missile units off the field. Guys, just keep firing up these guys. My other general, I think you can now get in on the action. Right, you guys break off this side. General, line up here. General is under attack. General and in we go with a charge. Just pop the fear and the inspire. I think we do need now. So. Right, these guys are broken. Right, in guys can come in. You guys go for a long walk. Because I don't need you. Okay. How are we doing over here? Step watchers out. Got here. Step archers out. You're in combat. Get out, I don't want you in combat. What I want is you guys to come this way. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I'm not 100% this morning, guys. Of course, I'm still. It's just the end of the holiday period. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Guys are crumbling. End battle. 
and we lost 132 mainly from our artillery looks like our artillery got probably a bit a too close to the action we killed 3129 I say not the most difficult of battles but that's the way it is and that should be the end of these guys and I think we're just going to occupy if we can afford it yep, these guys are gone and what we're going to do make the Sukhalids happy see if we can offer to join their be war welcome here and speak as join you their wish war against me fear to of consequence or danger and they've accepted My That's people will fight. that should make them friendly again because are now at war these guys and what I want to do is kind of push down as quickly as possible through here so we can move down this way so our income has gone right through the floor simply because we've got this here I think we can yeah, we can knock these down I don't think gonna get it from here 462 well I suppose we can live with that guys and of course what we're gonna do is repair this or food to food got plenty of food do seven five three eight three eight I think we're just gonna do that course, what we're gonna do is build up a temple and some more food in this area so that we can actually convert this area what's the culture like at the moment it's 10 against 6 and 8. Okay, we'll, we'll be okay with that. Of course, what I do want to do is bring this army down as well. Probably going to ruin our economy again. Bring you down, camp. Your job is going to be to deal with any rebels, keep the public order while we move down because I, I want to kind of blitz down into this area immediately because at the moment the leader atropine have got the ability to come up through there and I don't think there's much else we can do this turn guys so I'm just going to go for an end turn right got hidden agent exposed of course what can this can't actually hit this lot this turn so up to the border yep, don't you patrolling gonna have to very careful with the cashier guys fix the garrison here 15 he could sweep in just keep the momentum going let's have a quick look at this province got Gazik here Ragu over there, so I could blitz in with this army in good condition. And it's not a general I really want to fight with, actually. Come to think of it, Let's have a quick look. We got this guy here, characters. Let's deal with this guy. Baron lands, one of our magistrates is claiming the lands of Baron, so we'll fertilize that. My generals. My faction are actually in power. The Lagus, well, you're actually getting close to the end of your life. We got this guy here. He's other nobility, but he's actually higher up than these guys. Okay, a quick check of the politics. Yeah, I mean this guy's going to die soon because he's 63. But then my faction leader is also. 68 so that could be an issue okay I think what we are going to do guys is we're going to take a bit of a chance what is the garrison here garrison here Persian militia spearmen Persian archers we've got one set of Persian lances yeah I think we're going to go for it guys again we've got the I'm going to fight this game, guys, cause, simply because I just want to keep the casualties to the absolute minimum. And, of course, they've stayed in the settlement. That could be a little bit interesting. And 
Oh, this is one of my favourite settlements to attack, actually. Can do is come in from this direction. Draw, hopefully draw them through into a killing field here. So I think we'll put our battle line up here. And, as I say, well, have only got the two offensive troops, so you can come behind. General, you can sit behind there. These guys. General. You connect there. So we've got some archers who will pick up the front, and I think what we will do is, I think if we form these guys into two groups, not that I actually ever use groups, have four and four on each side. Okay. And for us, what we're going to do is the archers forward. And we're just going to move these guys forward a bit. I don't want to. And we're just going to bring horse archers up on each flank. Oh, so we've got rocks there, actually. Okay, that's novel. Put the X warriors out onto each flank. Commander. Yes, Commander. Okay. I'm just going to move these guys forward. We've got a bit of a defensive line here. Let's archers. The archers forward. Moving these guys. Bit of a bottleneck here. I think what we might do is these guys into this gap here. And these guys out onto each flank. Like that. Okay. We're just going to move these guys forward. They're actually quite rightly waiting for us. Kind of a bit inclined. Archers out this way. Kind of sweep in and hit them with a cavalry action. And I think you guys can come that way. Okay. Drop the fire in on these guys. Range. Let's put into the gap. Come up this way. Support this side. Operation Warriors. Come up this way. Okay. I think what we're going to do is see if we can get in and hit these archers here. If we can take down their archers. Okay. Doing here. Taking a little bit of damage onto those guys. Yep, I think we're gonna get a cavalry action here. A bit of a risk. Because if these guys can actually but if we can sweep this flank, take out these archers. Okay. Sweep in through. Okay. I think a couple of Persian light archers in here. Okay, we're just going to micro these guys in. And what I do want to do is take out these guys. Superior local force. Okay. Keep these guys behind. I think we'll bring the general up on this support this flank. Okay. Keep these guys running. We can catch them before they get in amongst this. Oh, that's brutal. That Ah, that's not good. Okay. Let's 
step archers. Break away this way. Oh, this is all okay. You guys, come this way. That was a bit of a mistake, there, guys. These guys took a lot more damage than I thought they would. Okay. How are these guys did? Those are nearly out of ammunition. Archers. Bringing these guys round the back. These guys shot their all their ammunition. Okay. Start to advance. Days advance. The archers. Start and fire onto these. Guys. One of our units has used all its okay. ammunition. Yeah, archers pull back. You guys come up on this flank. You guys start to advance on this. They're coming out at us. So. Okay. Rations. Okay, out. Okay. Guys coming this way. General. You guys can come out that way. Okay, Thracians. This has got a bit of a mess. But Thracians, you can come in this way. Max Warriors this way. You guys just keep these guys kind of fixated. General, you come round here. Okay. I want two of you. I want you now, guys, to come and push on this flank. Axe warriors. warriors this way. Thracians. Thracians. Now pushing on these guys. We're going to be okay, guys. Right. General. Guys, break through. If we can actually get a X warriors. X warriors in, we're, we're okay at the moment. We're not taking. Guys, okay. Wait, you go. What general? Wait, what are you doing up there? Right, these guys are breaking off here. guy needs support. He's not really designed for fighting here. You guys come around that way. These axe warriors are very very exposed at the moment. I think maybe. What are we doing? Okay. Guys, push on these archers. Okay. Let's come here. Right. General, come up, General. You guys need to push on this flank. Keep these guys. Okay. 
celebrations in guys come over this way celebrations you push on these guys these guys are losing decisively general where art for art thou come here okay cop you guys push through here these guys busy who's wavering Shouldn't have done that, guys. Okay, yep. guys, falling on these Thracians come this way. Right. Hey, I told you to get over there. Okay, where's these guys? and cavalry this way general pull back although I'm very tempted to get him killed actually okay. guys form up hey step archers pull out right, these guys Make sure. Okay, crush in here. These guys are killing my own troops. These guys get away. It's combat even. Then we'll break away. Cav. This is getting a bit more messier than I was hoping for. Again, you guys back. Axes, pull back, pull back. Thracians, fall back. do is kill these guys using archery fire that might be a good way to do this okay Guys are literally dying. This is some cavalry. Yep, these guys are. Yep. These guys, the Royal Guard, have got put the actual armor to protect themselves. Fresh, active, fresh, yep. Yeah. Actually, okay. Guys, pull away. And I think, actually, let's take them all the. All the cavalry away as well. I think you're just doing more damage than good. Okay, these guys are breaking, so bring these guys in. Thracians. Guys, just mount up here. I think these guys can deal with it. Double time. Uh, 
and in we go. We got the heavy phalanx and general. Yep, end battle. A bit more messy than I thought it was going to do. We lost 449. Uh, general took a little bit more damage than he should have done. Maybe I should have got him killed. But ow. I hate losing generals. I know it's good politics to to actually kill them in this new thing, but okay. And we've got this guy down. Of course, we're now going to have a problem with cash money gain. Going to get five hundred. Um, going to do it. Uh, what can we? Get? We can't convert that to anything. And. Gonna make us money, but at the same time, I don't really want that. I think what we're gonna do is just push through like this. There's my agent. My agent's down here. Yep. I think you. Yep. The media atropine are pretty well exposed. Got this area here. Wow. Okay, we're gonna need to. I haven't actually, so we're going to have to cancel that. Don't know all about these. I'm just going to have to get that and that in there. Not a bad mistake there, guys. Okay. Public order there. Yeah, it should. We'll be okay. We'll have that under control. And these guys are just going to have to rest a little bit. Okay, the general's got some traits I think we're gonna certainly gonna need you to give us a bit of cash okay and give us some empire maintenance no how big's the garrison here this is gonna be a 20 garrison okay and I think we can go one more turn guys Yep, got an increase in rank, hidden agent exposed, political intrigue, okay. Assassination failed, but attackers managed to inflict some non fatal wounds. Oh great. Not as though I want this. Okay, we're gonna have to What's this. We're gonna have to this new guy. We're gonna have to bring this guy back in again. He's an experienced general. Baron Lands. The improved saw. The improved saw provided a bumper harvest following the year. Farmers are praised. Okay. And what I'd like to do is for these guys to come down. And this general is actually leading. And he can't move. Great. That's because I've had to replace him. Okay. Guys, just pull back and fortify outside of here. And again, I will go put the temple that in there. And we'll get. And we're losing cash now. Wow. Okay. What's actually? I think. What's actually? Why are we losing cash? That's because we've lost the general here. Right. Don't think I can bump my taxes even higher. Oh no, I can go take my taxes up. Okay. I've forgotten. I normalised my taxes whilst I was moving my army south, and of course it's winter. Yeah, I've forgotten. These guys who actually got wounded then. Oh yeah, this guy. Okay, I think that's all we can do this turn, guys. I'm gonna go. For, I think what I can do is. I don't have an army here, so I think. Okay, we're gonna go one more turn, guys. For a quick battle. Got some unassigned skills. Iron here. What I would like is a movement range. I mean, there is some action going on here, and I have been neglecting my spy over here. I'm not too interested in the action here. I'm actually interested in what's going on over here. Now, these guys are good. So we can move our spy back over again, so I'm just going to go for an intern, guys. Okay, got a hero. Okay, we're going to come over here. And hopefully this army yep, can come in, attack here, 
and I want you to encircle. So we're going to bring this army down in support because I want overwhelming odds. And I think I can do this battle to end this part, guys. 78. Meter Atropine don't seem to have any armies. I don't know where they are, which is slightly concerning. But okay, we're just going to come in here. Could do the auto resolve, but that would probably damage these guys. I am going to fight this, guys. This should be a quick battle. So. The enemy sallies out, which is good. Oh, we're in trees. Great. Okay, start deployment. I think what we will want to do are. That's coming in through the trees. Okay. What we're going to do is we're going to draw these guys into this killing field here, and then the reinforcements can attack from that flank. And we're going to do exactly the same as with four. Gonna, um, I think we're going to set ourselves back this. I don't really think we're just going to set ourselves back this way. And I think I'm just going to put the ballistas behind. And I think we have the main concentration of our troops there, have the slingers out in front, they've got a little bit of cav so I think you guys can cover this flank and I think we'll have the step archers up here, general yeah, here, hopefully our reinforcement archers, step archers will be able to come through so I'm just going to start the battle guys. And We'll just put you guys in there. Okay, we're just going to speed this up, a, up a little bit. I want you to team up with this general, keep you out of mischief. I want you to come, actually, you keep out of mischief. You two going together. Okay, a heavy line. Oh, I'm not interested in you. You can stay back. guys can come in this way uh, that's who I'm looking for again you can keep out of the battle horse archers I really really want you coming in this way right, these guys are coming up this flank cav okay I want you guys to hit those heavy lancers. That's there too. Okay. What we got over here? We got some he more Persian heavy shock coming in. You guys on flaming shot. Back it's that way. Guys, come out that way. Guys, hit these. Our hidden units have been Kick. discovered. Hey, you guys. That should wreck this cavalry unit. Yep. These guys should be able to suck that up. Okay. Our hidden units have been you guys draw off these. Field artillery, Field artillery, you switch your attention back on the garrison units. These guys are virtually broken. Back to normal shot. You start hitting air. Okay. Their cav is gone. 
That now gives us the cav superiority that I'm looking for. These guys come forward. Who's this? Step archers. Okay, you guys just keep these entertained. What have we got over here? Ah, yeah, the damaged units. Okay, who's taken any real damage here? These guys are broken. Hoplites start to come around onto this flank. Oops. Jacksman. Wait, pull away, pull away. Oh, come on. Warriors eager for blood. Our hidden units have been discovered. Okay. Hoplites push on this flank. You guys, I want you to sweep the rear. this okay sweep the back line where's my general right you guys fall onto these okay got them now Yep, with the general. You guys push the center. Wait. You guys One of our units drop used all its and withdraw. Scrum general here, but that's okay. okay. Shoot you guys, slingers. The battle is turning in our favor. Back, yeah, probably killing more of my troops than anything else. Okay, we've got the other general here. Archers. Right, you guys fall on these generals. Want you to form up here. Rear charges. Our hidden units have been discovered. Right, these guys have been smashed and destroyed. Okay, axes. Okay, they're all crumbling now. Cavalry in the back. Sorry, I missed the charge there, guys. Where's my other general? General's out. Yep, end battle. We lost 330 on that. A little bit more messier than I could. Lots and lots of friendly fire, though. Generals did very well. 242 kills. Yep, I think we did pretty well there, guys. And we've got another settlement for meter atropine. And theory now, okay, enough. We're just gonna snatch the there, and that now puts us right on the border 
think that's their last settlement. I think command. you guys can you just fortify the game. I think. Can we convert that to? We can't convert that to anything. We can convert that to. Very tempted. We need the barracks here so we can knock that down. Can't convert that. Okay. So we've now got two parts of this area. I mean, obviously, we're going to get a rebellion in the next part. In fact, I think what we will do is let's move you back here. And you can just stand there for the moment. Because if we get a rebellion here or here, this army can literally knock the rebellion back. How are we doing here? This is still minus 12, but I think it's going to turn around. That's the main problem here. Cultural differences, province stability will rebel in six turns. But we'll get the temple going fairly soon there. And I don't think we can get anything else cash wise here. No, that's only got 1,900. So we're doing okay, guys. We made a lot of progress down into here. We can take this settlement here, which has got, what we can do is get this in a siege battle. That will destroy Meda Atropine. Uh, the Suclids still like us. I really, really need to keep the Suclids on side because they're going to be my buffer here. And yep, they're very friendly. They like us. We're, we're taking combat against those. About Persia, Persia actually hates us, but they will be our next target. Got Parthia here. They're actually friendly at the moment. Okay, can we? Who are they actually at war with? The Eder Atropine, Sakuru. Okay. Can we get a little bit of a trade friend. deal with it? Greetings. No. Okay. Maybe non aggression. No. Okay. Because I'm quite happy for these guys to stay our friends moment because what I want to do is literally take these three regions and then we're going to have a period of consolidation but I think this is where I'm going to leave it guys hope you enjoyed the episode hope you found it interesting sorry it's a bit disjoint but the holiday period is still kind of not tailing off now but there's still distractions and I've gone keep I'm kind of recording this with one eye looking out the door so this is where I'm going to leave it hope you enjoyed the episode hope you found it interesting and until next time whatever you do Enjoy your gaming.